Ukraine's foreign minister greeted by NATO Secretary General Jens Stoltenberg. This second day of the military alliances gathering in Brussels saw an inaugural meeting of the NATO-Ukraine Council. Ahead of the talks, Kyiv said Ukraine needs more weapons for its fight against Russia. It will not be an exaggeration to say that defending Europe without Ukraine is a futile task. You cannot do it simply for one simple reason, because we currently have this, the strongest and the most uh, battle-hardened army uh, in Europe. At the gathering, NATO allies vowed to remain steadfast in their commitment to further step up political and practical support to Ukraine. Welcome to this first meeting of the NATO-Ukraine Council at the level of foreign ministers. We remain unwavering in our commitment to Ukraine. We are determined that Ukraine will one day sit at this table as a full member of our alliance. The meeting also saw the return of former British Prime Minister David Cameron, this time as Foreign Secretary. On the ongoing war, Stoltenberg said Ukraine has inflicted heavy losses on Russia.